I'm at Taylor Swift today. Less than five hours ago, I was hugging Taylor Swift. <laughs> it's so crazy. Okay. Well, I've been getting a lot of questions and everything about like that, so I thought I'd make a YouTube video, and then I can explain everything. So, let's start from the beginning. Okay. So, some of you would have noticed I made this painting for Taylor. Basically, my plan or hope was to give her this. On the back, I've done like a collage of pictures and everything like that. And then there's an envelope for a letter to go. So, this morning, wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Get myself dressed. Hair was actually straightened, but now it's not. <laughs> so, mum like super speed drives. And we get to the shard roughly five, half five in the morning. And so, then we're like freaking out because we're the only ones, first ones there. And we're like, oh, we get to pick where we stand. So we pick right opposite the door so we can see her going up the stairs when she leaves us. And then about 15 minutes later, we're joined by Bridget, who's an amazing Swifty, who we met. We met so, like... There was only about 10 of us, which was the good thing. So I think everyone was going to BBC Radio 1 because more people knew about that. And so it meant we had more time with Taylor because there was only like 10 of us. But everyone that went was really nice. And we had, we put um, Shake It Off on really loud on the loudspeaker and we were dancing at half five in the morning, me and Bridget. And the security guard just couldn't stop laughing at us and he had to like shut the door. But it was fun. And then, so, next, what happened next? Okay, so then once we were all there, we just start, like, getting a bit excited because um, there's a couple of packs of our teeth start showing up and then we're like, oh my god, this is actually going to happen. And then, we see this big black Range Rover and the bars have been dropped and she's driving right towards us and then we're all, like, screaming. Mum's like, Jamie, put out your sign! So I'm like, this, that with my sign. And then, so, she pulls up and then... I see her head, the top of her head in the car, and I'm like, oh my god, she's wearing a hat. But I didn't really see her face. And then I saw someone was with her, and then we was like, what side is she on? And then the side we were on, her publicist came out, and we were like, no, it was like, we're ple like please can Taylor just come and see us? And then Taylor got out the other side, and we were all like, Taylor, Taylor, like screaming, hoping she would come and like greet us. And then obviously we knew she would, because she's perfect. So then we like, Where's she gone? And then all of a sudden, she's like running around the other side of the car and she's like appeared. And I start like, I'm crying at this point. So then I'm like the second person she, like second or third person she greets. And so she greets this other girl and then she comes to me and I'm like, I'm like, I made you this. And I give her my poster and she goes, oh, you don't, you don't want to give that away. That's too good. That's too nice. And then I said, but I do. I was like, I've got, po I've got. A layer and stuff on your, their back for you and so basically I force her to have it I'm like you will have this and then she's like that's like thank you so much and then she's like do you want a picture or something and I'm like uh yes but I didn't have my camera on me because I was going to try and get the autograph so I was like where's mum and then uh, mum was there so I was like um yeah and we pointed and she posed and she was like hugging me and I was like and then we were posing but mum couldn't really get a very good picture because everyone was in the way and so I think she got one but I'm like this and I've got like a double chin and I don't know how I've got a double chin in that picture but I have, but I have. anyway her coat like I'm going to sound like a like really weird but like her coat was cashmere and it was so soft like I was like I want your coat and then she was like walking along signing people's pictures and I was like oh my god she's still holding my painting she had my painting for like three quarters of the line and so she was holding it and then she gave it I think she gave it to her security guard I'm pretty sure I remember her giving it to her security guard but then I ended up looking around and she had her publicist had it so I think I don't know if she wanted to look at it and then she took it off of her or what but I was just so happy that she took it and then like yeah and I was just like oh my god and then my mum was like Jamie did you get the autograph and I was like no so my mum grabbed my Vogue and my Sharpie and she ran over and Taylor signed it. And Okay, so let's just take a moment that to realise that the Sharpie I use for school, my art Sharpie, has been touched by Taylor Swift. She has used this exact Sharpie. And I'm kind of like, I don't know if I want to use it ever again. Because like I might just frame it or put it in a sealed bag or something. Like, 
Do you know like in Friends when Phoebe gives Rachel a swab of spit or whatever it is? That's what it's like. It's like I want to save her DNA in case like I can clone her or something. But yeah, that will probably most likely be never used again. And then... There you go. See her signature there. So I'm going to try and find a frame for this. That's deep enough to fit that in because... Oh my god. But my mum did say that we might just end up having to cut off the cover and frame the cover. But I thought that was pretty cool. So, yeah. Okay, some of you guys had some questions, so I was going to answer them now. Right, what did she say to you? I've already covered that. So, um, what did she smell like? Incredible fins or Wonderstruck? Now, I was a bit too like, oh my god, Taylor was talking to me and oh my god, Taylor coat is so soft. <laughs> I actually didn't really, like, smell her, but I can tell you she did smell nice, and I don't think it was Wonderstruck, so maybe it was, it was a bit more, like, musky, kind of, like, sandalwoody, rather than, like, flowers and berries, so if that's incredible things, then it smells good. Um, were her eyes blue or green? I think they were blue. Did you get an actual photo with her? Yes, and I will show you them maybe now while I'm talking, or maybe afterwards. Um, was she really tall? She was really tall, but her heels were like, I do like, not know how she was walking in them. They were like really thin and high, so like, I was like, bow down to Taylor. Okay, are you alive? Uh, yes, but barely. <laughs> um... What did the publicist do with it? The painting, she was just holding it. So I guess she's keeping it. Maybe, hopefully, Taylor reads it. Um, so, yeah. How does it feel? Like, and how is she, how tall is she? So I've discussed the tall thing. And I don't really know how to explain the how does it feel like bit. Because at the minute, it's a bit like... But it's like I'm still wearing the clothes that I wore. And it's like Taylor Swift has touched this part of my cardigan. And I just may not be okay, like... She's actually hugged me and she's touched my hair and like, oh my god. What did it feel like when you first saw her? Well, when she ran around the car and she just appeared, I started crying so much. And I was like, oh my god. And I was like, a proper like, fangirl moment. Yeah. What was your first impression on her when you saw her and talked to her? First impression, I was like, oh my god, how amazing does she look? Two, oh my god, this is like I'm in a real life candid. And three... She looks perfect. My mum's first thing was, hasn't she got nice skin? And I was like, mum, I just hugged Taylor Swift. Anyway, and when I talked to her, my first impression was like, oh my god, please just take my poster. Please don't be nice about it. Please just take it. But I was like, yeah, she's sweet. So, when she, what she, well, I want to know what she said when she laid her eyes on you for the first time and pretty much the whole story. So I've told you the whole story. First time laying her eyes on me, she was about to say hi, I think. Or oh, I think she maybe said hi, I don't know, it's a bit of a blur. And I was like, I made you this. Because I was just too excited, I just wanted her to have my poster because it's got a letter in it and I knew I wouldn't be able to speak. So I was just like, have it. Um, is she nice? Does she act super sweet to her fans? Yes, yes. And the rest of them are all, did she smell nice? Which is basically what I've already answered about the incredible things in, which is a bit like... I don't know, I didn't, like, <laughs> sniff her, but she did smell nice, yeah. Okay, so I guess I could do, like, a slideshow of pictures now. Thank you for listening, and thank you for all the nice comments, and oh my god, I met Taylor Swift. Oh my god, this is, like, like, I want to remember this feeling forever kind of thing, so this is what the video is for.